and I, I don't know if you've watched um, Max Carson, Mr. Girl, went mm. after Destiny for having this conversation. His claim was like, you're sanitizing Nick. And when you become friends with somebody, you sanitize them. But it also has the effect of sanitizing him and making people think, <laughs> oh, he's not so bad. Which I, in some sense, agree with and understand, maybe understand more so than agree with. But I think if Nick Fuentes is ha is having a conversation with Destiny, he has to change. He has to morph. He has to drop some of the just absurd nonsense in order to even begin to have a conversation. Right. So I think that's the converting aspect. Well, I mean, if he if that's true, if he's sanitizing Nick, then actually wouldn't that be a good thing for people that are that are against the right? Because it's like, well, if if now he's forced or he's being presented in a way that's more safe then he's kind of adapting to the the tone that destiny is setting right so right because i've seen nick literally say like uh, you know i was in a tell i was in a twitter space with a bunch of trans people and they were telling me like nick we don't hate you so much you know we just disagree with you but we believe in your right to free speech and he was like oh that was pretty cool you know but i am trying to understand where you guys are coming from and and i even did a twitter space where i was talking to some of them and there were like some trans people on and they're saying like look like i don't hate you but this is like where we're coming from and i said well okay i think i get it and then he quickly i saw him it was in the conversation he quickly was like well just mean i agree with their degeneracy or whatever and i said well okay i think i get it not like not like i empathize but like you know i i understand the view sure but like like mm -hmm. that was the, that was the beginning of him like oh actually the things that i claim to hate I don't actually hate. I hate like a, a you know caricatured version of it. And mm. by honestly engaging with you know people who are transgender or something like that, it's like oh actually maybe Nick realizes it's not the fact that they're transgender that's a problem. It's the fact that you know a lot of transgender ideology gets associated with far left ideology, which is a problem in and of itself. But it's not the it's not the fact that they're transgender is the problem. Mm. But like his ideology would purport that it's the fact that they're transgender that that's the problem.